ain't been up on the block in a minute. Uh, I've been missing out the walk with the minute. Uh, uh, I've been building up the blocks like a me. Uh, uh, Elliot got water dripping out the city. Uh, uh, oh my god, uh, boy, he got his glide. Uh, uh, oh my god, uh, boy, that boy on top. Uh, what, sip and walk. What up, and this is John Shabor, IBS Kelso coming back with another MX Box banging up before you adjust your phone brightness and change your monitor settings. Yes, I am black, we're playing a dirt bike game. But now we're playing Super Moto game, all right? And the reason being said is my boy TML was actually able to come out with a huge tra traction control update for the Super Motos. I don't know if you guys have been following, but I've been doing a lot of day one, day two of mastering Super Moto life and doing the nose wheelies and all that. I know it's been a huge controversy, nose wheelie stoppy, yes. I, I, I said it to literally get everybody active on their feet. <laughs> But with that being said, um, yeah, he came out with an update, man. I literally, there's no traction in these tires. I wanted the update. I wanted to feel comfortable. I want to bring Supermoto to life. So I've been doing a lot of that stuff. Um, so finally, he was able to make it, and now I'm able to make this for a Saturday video. So hopefully, you guys enjoy this. Um, this will be the posted on the day of uh, after Ariel. So. With that being said, I'm super excited to allow this to happen. Hopefully you guys get to test this out. Maybe we do some super motor races and elimination races. Maybe we'll add a little series to it. But thank you so much. Um, he also came out with different things that you can be doing for your, uh, for your like, I guess, kicking out. And um, you can really get, like, really in-depth with the super moto life of it. So I'm going to be downloading all that here soon. Um, it's about putting stuff in certain spots and certain files to make it work. So once when I figure that out, I'll get it all right. But we're here at one of these cool maps. I think it's like Lono 04 or Long or something like that. Um, I think it's like 04 to 15. So yeah, we'll do some laps, man. I can show you that the traction really does help. If you guys want to go back to any of my shorts and see like how slippery it is, you're so much grip in these tires now. Now, maybe not to the full extent to where you're like literally, you know, gripped down, but you can at least slide the back tire, which is really great. And it creates a lot of fun uh, super moto. Uh, traction because it's all about sliding that back uh, tire anyway and then you like bring it back to you I don't know if you guys ever seen any supermoto videos of them sliding the back Ooh. Okay, that was too much of a slide, but it's not a full complete like yo You have the, all the traction in the world, right? But it's a start to what we had before I kid you not show you where we were before this I would literally slide everywhere you, would, you wouldn't even be able to be on the gas so to be able to see this is a huge improvement and um, yeah, it's, it's allowing supermotos to be a huge thing. Now, uh, for a lot of you guys that haven't really seen any of my content, I do have a Supermoto IRL. I have a KTM 450 Supermoto, and uh, I gotta say, I love every minute of riding that bike, dude. So, it's kind of was just something to where it's like, man, I want to be able to actually use this in, like, in in the game to IRL. I am on a 250 right now. I probably should have hopped on a 450, but the 450 was too much power before, so I kind of was scared to hop on it because there's no traction, but now I'm very curious, right? So we're on the 250 KTM, and man, it feels great. I also want to say for my, uh, oh, still got to be careful. I also want to say for my nose wheelie stuff, it might be dead in the water. You're so much traction in these bikes now that you might not be able to uh, do any more huge wheelies. Unless I f figure out a, uh, a plan for it to where it's like the perfect tire now, the perfect uh, braking, you know, all that. I, I'm probably pretty much going to be able to figure that out. So for now, we work on the best traction, and I'd rather have more traction than knowing that I can't nose wheelie, but I can at least stop it. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah, just be able to actually ride these and be viable. So soon I'm going to go ahead and make sure I have one of these uh, nice little suits on and all that. And I know TML was talking that he came out with PSDs and all that, where it's you can get fully customizable with it. So. I hope you guys enjoy this, and I really hope you guys see more about these. I'm looking to at least make two videos of these a week. Um, I do want to start that up, so this is going to be my own little new Supermoto series of mastering Supermoto life and MX bikes. I've already had the shorts for it, so i got to slow down a little bit more. So I've already had the shorts for it, so now I need to make it into a series of, um, you know, a video long, long, term, long term. So hopefully we get a race here going. Um, I did hear that he has a actual uh, server up now, so we're going to have to check that out. Maybe get a couple friends, really encourage people to actually ride this. Um, and let me know down in the comment section if you guys want me to come out with a video on how to download all this because it's it's a whole new pack. It's not your own. It is OEMs, but it's not like not like a drag and drop. There's a certain way you got to download everything for these tires to show up because before they weren't showing up for me and you had to download the Geo Pandas, but there's like two different links for the Geo Panda uh, tires and you have to make sure you uh, use the bottom ones, not the top ones. So. I should, I, I feel like encouragement wise, I need to make a video on it just so everybody is in the in the game because you feel like you're getting discouraged and you're like, oh, well, I'm not going to give it a go no more if I can't literally get
get these bikes to work, right? And that's kind of like where you don't want to, you know, deter anybody. So I got to make sure I get that correctly. But man, this uh, track, man, I think it, I think there's like seven of these tracks in one pack. Uh, you can press the cool file, file. So hopefully you get some really good racing here. I got to work on my brakes. <laughs> I got to work on my brakes, uh, being able to slow down and really pressing up. So let's try to get real close and I guess not try to fall again when we try to get back on there. But Traxxon has upgraded tremendously and that's what we, we, all we can ask for, to be honest with you. So let's push up on this 250. Let's see if we can set down a real good burner here. Oh, you see that? Now that's what's up. Now if I would have tried to do that before, I would have slid into oblivion. So really cool to see that you're actually able to slide the back tire now. Nice. Press up on it. And you gotta, now you gotta use like the certain lines, right? Cool thing about Supermoto, it's almost like actually riding a car. <laughs> it's almost like driving a car. You gotta make your, like, if you ever did a set of courses, you gotta hit the correct lines, use the right spots, and if you really wanna go fast, you know? It's all about hitting the correct, like, spots on the track, which is really sick. When to, when to slow down, like that line right there was for you to slow down um, and make that good turn and make that good tight turn. So it's gonna be a really new ball game and Man, I love it, dude, already. For the fact that these these bikes are feeling this comfortable, oh my gosh. So you guys are probably gonna see a lot of... Dude, I almost, almost to the finish and I let him go again. Dang it. You guys are gonna see a lot more videos on this. Um, I really wanna bring a uh, super mode. I just want another avenue of approach for this game, right? You got the bike life if you wanna do bike life and you know do all those ride outs. You got the motocross, you got the supercross, you got... I feel like the only place that we're really lacking in this game now which it comes to my mind is enduro and supermoto right i don't think enduro is not too far off the lead i can't say too much about that but there is something really fun happening there as well i'm super excited to be in uh, hopefully be a part of that here soon um but enduro uh something cool is happening there and then um now su uh, now supermoto so i'm definitely going to be working on this if we can literally get a series running and more races yeah i'll, I'll do we'll do elimination right dang my brakes suck my brakes suck oh I don't know if that's the bike's bricks are. Oh! Gotta be slower down. I don't like it. Let's try to hit the wheelie down the straight. Oh, no, dude. It's something about that corner, bro. I gotta be able to get it right. Dang it, dude. That, that's the cool thing about it. Now it's a whole new it's a whole new field. You really gotta, like. You really gotta get used to it, man. So. Man, this is gonna be a challenge. Day one, ladies and gentlemen, or episode one for now, mastering supermoto life and MX bikes. So I'm really happy to uh, be able to start this series up. Once again, if you guys haven't checked out my my shorts to it, I think that's a really great thing. Um, I was happy to see that you know it was able to get the attention it deserved for people that's been wanting or doing supermoto stuff and actually be like, you know what? TM TL was like TM was like it's literally like the easiest fix and I fixed it. So kabow, kaboom. There we have it. Slow her down. Oh, what a slide. What a slide. I'm on a game mode. Oh, man. That's sick. Let's get her done, baby. Let's get her done. I think for an introduction-wise, a good 10-minute, 12-minute video just to show you, man, that it's viable now. You can actually ride it. So I know the IBS Kelso community is going to get all up on this, dude. Now that's feeling good. Now we're feeling comfortable on the bike. Now we're picking up some speed. I'm understanding what what uh what gear I need to be in, how much speed I can use, because now I'm wrapping around, dude. Oh yes. Get a little wide. Come on, hold that, hold that, nice. Hug tight, hug tight. Yes, sir. I really want the animations. I really want the animations. I think I'm gonna get those animations here for next video. I'm gonna get those to work. I want the animations and I want the suit. I want a toe drag swag, baby. I want a toe drag. Oh, I was supposed to slide. I was supposed to skirt. So I think that line in the cage you can you can scrape or skirt, and then that's how you get real close in. So I want that toe drag swag. We're gonna be working on that for next episode. So holy smokes! There we go. Let's send it off. Slow down, late. Oh no! Too much. Oh, dude, I really tried to push it to the limits right there. Just wasn't it. Really tried to push it to the limits. Let me know if this is uh, something that you guys would love to see more about. I mean, like I said, I'm going to create it no matter what. But um, if this is something to like incentivize you to be like, yo, I think the bike's reliable. I definitely want to give them a go. Come through, man. I'll definitely try to make a video on it. I believe TM said he was going to try to make like, a quick little video about it as well. So if anything, I just want to get more clout about on how to download these correctly. Because I, I just don't want to lead you guys high and dry to where now 
oh cool this looks cool but how do i really download it because it loki gave me a trip for at first as well if you don't download correctly in the right format it will leave you for a loop to where you just like oh well, i don't want to give it a, a second go or a second try to download so definitely hopefully get that right with you guys but man you're so many tracks in this map dude we're gonna have some real fun trying to master all the craft Dang it, I'm, I'm holding down the throttle too much and it's allowing the back end to spin. I'm gonna have to be careful on that. All right, one more lap. One more lap, we'll call it. We'll call it even, huh? That's so amazing. That was so awesome. I'm gonna have to look up more on like um, the rules of Supermoto, like what counts as cuts, what doesn't. Because I know these red lines indicate something to where you can have one wheel out at one time or something like that. Only, and um, that's what like either indicates it or not. I gotta fix these brakes, bro. I gotta fix these brakes. I feel like I just, I'm not stopping on a dime. I might also forget that I did not put uh, combined brakes on, so that might be me right now. I, I, I think I did not put combined brakes on, and that's what's not making me stop the bike in good time. All right, come on, don't, don't fail me now. I need it, I need it. Ladies and gentlemen, I need it, here we go. Slow, 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 go. Grab the traction. Too easy, I'll take that. That's a burnt piece in my, in my books. Ladies and gentlemen, if you guys enjoyed this, a quick little bird piece, just to introduce us into episode one. Hopefully you guys enjoy it, Mastering Supermoto Life. So, thank you guys so much, and I'll catch you guys all in the next one. It's your boy, IBS Kelso. Pup, 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 p